As Cedra Mayfield tells us, family members of the boy say police went too far. He was tasered right here over his chest where there's three marks. Deandra Reed looks through pictures taken Thursday. You can see where the swelling, where there's an actual knot right there. Injury, she says her eldest son Marcus suffered after being tasered when he and his brother Levon were arrested at East Lansing High School. It was very excessive and, and unacceptable. According to a statement released by the school district, police arrested two students and tasered a third they say was resisting arrest. As officers tried to break up a lunchroom fight. He just grabbed me from behind and like told me I was arrested. Then he pulled out the um, taser on me and my brother. They tased him. They were trying to say he was resisting arrest, but he didn't know why he was getting arrested. All he kept asking was, why am I getting arrested? Officers here at the East Lansing Police Department did not wish to talk on camera, saying the incident remains under investigation. The Reed brothers insist a fight never happened and that the incident stemmed from rough handling of Marcus's girlfriend, who had just been suspended. They were trying to um, suspend his girlfriend for getting, I mean, take his girlfriend home in a police car for getting suspended. And she didn't want to ride home in a police car. She wanted her mom to pick her up. Mrs. Reed says she believes her sons, especially after seeing a recording of the incident caught on a school surveillance camera. I did not see any interaction between my son and the police officer at all. It was very clear that he was tasered. An incident this family is still trying to understand. In East Lansing, Cedra Mayfield, 6 News.